The Young and the Restless, Lie and R. Spoilers update for Monday, July 3. Indicates that Kyle Abbott, Michael Meadler, will spend some time flirting with Audra Charles, Zuleika Silver, and talking about her work goals. Kyle will also hope for another round in bed, so he'll put his number in Audra's phone and will feel certain she's going to get back to him. Although Kyle will seem a bit torn as he looks at a Skyle photo on his own phone, he'll put Summer Newman Abbott, Allison Lanier, out of his mind later and order some dazzling flowers for Audra. Kyle will also charge some diamond earrings to his account, so he'll really be working to impress Audra and reel her in. Meanwhile, Adam Newman, Mark Grossman, will snap at Nikki Newman, Melody Thomas Scott, when she tries to express how sorry she is about the daughter he lost. Although Nikki won't think Adam should let his rage take over, Adam will seem resigned to living with all the guilt and anger. Victor Newman, Eric Braden, will meet up with Adam later to express his condolences and try to push Adam to throw himself into work right now. Unfortunately, Victor won't agree with Adam's plan to go after Newman Media and will toss some threats around to keep his son in line. Adam won't seem deterred by Victor's disapproval and will fully intend on running McCall Unlimited the way he wants. At Newman Enterprises, Victoria Newman, Amelia Heinel, will put Nate Hastings, seen Dominic, in charge of some major meetings and projects, so Nikki will seem concerned over the news. When Nikki realizes Victoria has dissolved Nick's team, that'll bring some bickering as well. Nikki will point out that Nick's leave of absence just started, but Victoria's already making decisions that seem like this is permanent. Victoria will deny that and point out that she just didn't want Nick's team members waiting around for him to come back. Since Nate didn't need extra guidance, Victoria will contend that she just assigned those employees to other divisions. Nikki will feel like Nick's being punished for trying to warn Victoria about Nate. Since Nick was right about Ashland Locke, Robert Newman, Nikki will suspect Victoria fears her brother is right about Nate as well, at least somewhere deep inside. Victoria will get fed up with everyone second-guessing her decisions and constantly rehashing all the Ashland drama. As far as Victoria is concerned, she'll be drawn to Nate because he actually supports her vision. Once Nikki finds Victor at society, she'll relay some worries about Victoria and the mode she's stuck in. Victor will have similar thoughts about Adam and will predict a head-on collision for his feuding children. Back in Victoria's office, she'll have a productive meeting with Nate and Audra. Since Audra will not get out of the park with all her preparations, Nate and Victoria will know Newman Media is in good hands. Victoria will hint about making Adam miserable through their showdown with McCall Unlimited and will like the fact that Nate's willing to fight alongside her. Other me and our spoilers say Sharon Rosales, Sharon Case, will put the belongings Cameron Kirsten, Lyndon Ashby, left for her in a bucket. Nick Newman, Joshua Morrow, will drench everything in lighter fluid and help Sharon set fire to it. So they'll feel like a symbolic way of burning the memory of Cameron to ashes and putting him out of her life. Although Nick will start to get rid of the Kirsten Incorporated paperwork, Sharon will stop him and decide she might be able to do something positive and charitable with the company. Despite the horror of everything Sharon went through with Cameron, she'll feel like she's rediscovered her strength and will be ready for a new beginning. The young and the restless spoilers say Sharon will reboot her life in the coming episodes, so stay tuned for updates on what that'll look like. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe our channel. Thank you.